Well, nearly five years after a truck was placed on a sandbar in the Ohio River, someone is at it again, this time with a camper. The camper was spotted early this morning, but how it got there is still somewhat of a mystery. For more, we join Eyewitness News' Cody Bailey, who is live right on that sandbar right now in the Ohio River. Cody, what have you turned up? Good afternoon, Brad. Yeah, a lot of people have come out to not only see the attraction, but to also spend some time on the water and the temporary beachfront that is set up across Evansville. You can see no strangers to when crews do their dredging in the Ohio River that people can take to the sand and have almost a beach day in the River City. People out playing games. We've got boaters as well. Uh, we also have some officials from the DNR <laughs> checking out the situation here to try and track down exactly and kind of find out that, uh, that mystery of how this RV camper arrived here on this sand bank along the Ohio River. Of course, many have made the trek across the Ohio, moving on their boats and spending the beach day to see the mystery of the uh, RV camper that is here on this sandbank. While there, no one is saying for sure how the camper arrived, there are some many speculations. Some say it was tied with a rope. Others say maybe a large trailer of sorts. And there are also some who are speculating that this is the same culprit who placed the truck here nearly five years ago. While the speculation is fun, residents like John Provo say they don't see any harm in this prank. We enjoy coming out here to have a lunch and enjoy the the ambiance and someone said hey man there's a camper out there we're like oh what a great idea so uh we think it's great well, provost also says he would enjoy himself spending time on the rv in the middle of the ohio but others say they're not so sure. Now, coming up on Eyewitness News Live at 5, we'll hear more reaction from people in the area on what they think of uh, their theories of how the RV arrived and what they expect to happen here in the coming days. Reporting live from the Ohio River, Cody Bailey, Eyewitness News. Looking forward to your report at 5. Thanks a lot, Cody.